Unity. <laughs> Welcome to the channel. My name is Rap Q. This is Rap on Point, and as you can see, we're about to get into a game called 1915. Now, I found this game on itch.io. Link will be in the description in case you want to try it out. And um. 1915 is a powerful little experience that would make a great companion. Oh, I'm reading the wrong thing. <laughs> 1915 is a short World War I narrative driven experience that puts the player in the role of a spectral observer to the Battle of Luz in 1915. So, sounds interesting, looks interesting, and uh, yeah, without further ado, further ado, without further ado, let's get into the game. Okay. That was cool. Hmm. In August 1914, the lamps went out across Europe. Great Britain entered the Great War. Across the nation, young men enlisted by the thousands in the spirit of optimism and adventure. One year later, the first large-scale British offenses took place at Luz, Europe. The Battle of Luz was meant to be a decisive breakthrough in a war to end all wars. It ended nothing. Okay. Should be interesting. Oh. Oh, okay, we're in the game. Uh. Um, all right, let's get into it. I do not know what to expect. I think this is more like a experience than a game. Uh, loose December 1915. So, yeah. It should be interesting. What's that say? Piccadilly Circus? Press A or space to time travel? September 25th, 1915. What? Was, ooh, can I grab this gun? Memoir found one out of 15. Keep, oh, keep to the trench in daylight by order. A terrific bombardment started, and the gas and colored smoke was released. It was impossible to see more than a few yards. Corporal Andrew Crawford, 10th Highland Light Infantry. All right, let's go this way real quick. Is my thing running smooth? I hope so. Um, let's go this way. I hear people talking. What's in here? This game looks nice, I'm not gonna lie. A uh, memoir found 2 out of 15. It was a long, deer deary or dreary, miserable night. Some chaps were crying, some praying, but most of us were optimistic. We all hoped that we would all come through. Uh, Corporal Edward uh, Glendingning? Gling ding ding. Oh, I'm sorry if I butchered that. 12 Battalion Knots and Derby Regiment. Okay. Oh. What? Oh, I could time travel. Okay. We went up to relieve several divisions. I can still remember the cheers. We never thought that. Oh, we never thought what was in front of us. Private Harry. Fellows, 12 as battalion. All right. My apologies if I butcher some of these names, but you know, I don't mean to. Okay. Oh, and I can't escape. That's crazy. So I need the time travel. All right. So what's over here? I'm liking the game. It's crazy. Uh, let's go this way. Hague Street. At midnight, a message came through the oh came through that the 6 a.m. attack would go on. We went to sleep for a few hours, wondering how many of us will be left to sleep tomorrow. Captain W. G. Baggett Chester, Second King. Edwards on Gurkha Rifles? Gurkha? Am I saying that correct? Then there's nothing here. A 
Okay, so 5 out of 15. Prior to going over, some of us brought portraits of our nearest and dearest. Wives and mothers whose faces were an incentive and inspiration. Better have a last look at them, boys, one said. Private James McMinn, 9th Battalion, Black Watch. Damn, alright, I got you. And now we could go this way. Wait. We looked back for reinforcements, but no help could we see. A third time we charged on that awful hillside. Truly, we were holding on to the mo oh, the motto. A camera never can yield. Private John Jackson, 6th Battalion, Camerons. Or Camerons. Okay, so we can't go back. We can't get this rifle. Let's go on. Alright. 7 out of 15. The whistle blew and the guns started firing. After all these months of sitting behind a wire, it made a lump rise in one's throat. Major H.F. Bitter, Royal Sussex Regiment. I can't use it here, okay. Eight out of 15. All of a sudden, there was a violent explosion at the front. As I crawled towards it, I could see the remains of the section. I could hear the cries and screams of the survivors. All of my romantic ideals of war all my romantic ideals of war vanished with that episode. Major HF Bitter Royal Sussex Regiment. Damn, okay. Suicide corner? What does that mean? Oh we could go through here. Nine out of fifteen. Field guns had blown the enemy's wire into the air. Pieces of German wire actually fell into our front line. Sergeant William Linton, Andrews, 4th Battalion, Black Watch. I could continue going. I can't go back though. Wait, I'm not missing. Wait, oh, can I go back? I'm not missing anything back there, am I? Okay, I hope not. I just keep it pushing. This game is what? What? The Battle of Luz ended on 8 October 1915 in defeat for the British. Over 20,000 men were killed. It would take three years before the Great War ended, claiming 16 million lives before the. Oh, I couldn't read the rest. It was one of the deadliest conflicts in human history. So I did miss some memoirs. You discovered 9 out of 15 memoirs. I know. I wanted to go back. Damn. This is a cool game. What's This is a cool experience. Because it's it has to do with real life. You know? Nine out of fifteen, huh? You know what? I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna find all the memoirs. I have to. I have to. All right, so I'm back in the game, y'all, and I'm just I'm gonna I'm gonna run through what like the memoirs already found. I'm gonna run through those quick, and then I'm gonna just basically, you know, read the ones that we didn't find. You know. Death Valley. Okay. Death Valley. I, I didn't read Death Valley. All right, so we're gonna go back. Let's go this way this time. Let's go down this way. This is on the opposite side, so. Alright, so we were issued with bread and cheese rations to last us for two days. We were told not to eat them until ordered. Private Harry Fellows, 12 as battalion. I can't. North. Northumberland? Okay. Any, oh, here we go. Another one. I can remember one of my friends died. 
and for a time I feel absolutely completely desolate. There is that feeling of comradish, uh, comradeship, comradeship, which can't be understood by anyone unless they were actually on the front line of war. Private Clifford Lane, 1st Battalion, uh, Hurt Fortshire Regiment. Okay. Alright. That's crazy. Alright, so we're gonna leave here. We're gonna go on this side. Alright, so we found 10. It was a very hazy morning, and you couldn't see far ahead. We had to keep close together to keep in touch with each other. Sergeant Thomas Bowman, or Bowman, 4th Battalion, Black Watch. That's crazy. Anything else here? Let's go. Let's go in here real quick. We were laughing and talking when the first met. Oh, I can't read. I'm sorry. We were laughing and talking when we first met the walking wounded. They said, you'll laugh on the other side of your rudy faces when you go over. It didn't bother us. We were members of the Queens, you know. Sergeant Charles Lippitt. 8th Battalion, Queens Royal West, Surrey Regiment. Alright, here's another one. When we when we did read the newspaper, it made us very angry. No action on the Western Front. 50 of our men killed and loose, and an equal number wounded isn't big enough. No action on the Western Front. Lieutenant Ulrich Burke. Ulrich Ulrich? Ulrich or Ulrich Burke, 2nd Battalion, Devonshire Regiment. Where's the other ones? We read that one already. This is a suicide corner. Yeah, that's where we could go through. All right, we found this one. But, uh, oh, where's the other one? All right, we didn't read this. Some of us had ladders and some got out as best they could. We soon found ourselves picking our way over the bodies of men who had fallen in the earlier attack. Corporal Edward, I'm not going to butcher that. 2nd Battalion, uh, 12th Battalion, Knots and Derby Regiment. That's crazy. Nothing in here. All right, before we continue, I'm just trying to make sure I caught everything. Just want to make sure I got everything. You know what? I think I did. Let's see if I did, okay? So. I messed up. Ah, I messed up. But, I mean, we basically got all of them. So, yeah. Alright. This is a crazy game. Well, it's a crazy experience. I love learning about the past. You know, our uh, world history. It's very important. So. Yeah, uh, okay. This was cool. To put it into a game like this? Yeah, I messed up because I went... Yeah, but I had all of them, basically. I had all of them. Because we did read the last one. But yeah, um, I will leave a link in the description in case you want to try it out. And uh, I really enjoyed this game because it's history. It's knowledgeable. You know, it's, a, it's, about our, it's about our past. And yeah, so, I mean, I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, please leave a like, share, and subscribe. Click that bell to get notified and updated to all my videos, so you can get to know this guy. Stay blessed, stay safe, and always rap on point. Never forget, I love every single one of y'all, and I'll catch on the next one, alright? Peace.
I do it for the why, why I do it for the grind, why I do it for the mind, I do it for the shine, I do it for my fam, living above, but most of all, I do it for the love, I do it for the why, why I do it for the grind, why I do it for the mind, I do it for the shine, I do it for my fam, living above, but most of all, I do it for the love.